coming at you with another video. Uh, this is a custom build for a friend, uh, Jason D. House. Uh, uh, I'm building a replica of his real truck. And as you can see, it's extensive plumbing. Uh, cut up the front axle on this AMT Peterbilt 352 and got the front axle to work. And we got plumbing all over the place here. Uh, all the way from the transmission, the compressor, alternator starters, everything. And including the uh, tilt pump, hydraulic lines, uh, all the air lines, as you can see. Uh, modified it by putting uh, Revell Peterbilt fuel tanks on here. And uh, they're plumbed as well. Plumbed the airbags, air brakes. Um, yeah, modified the cab extensively as well. Uh, he's got a later model, 79. And the door handles were down on the bottom, so I had to fill in the top holes. Made these striker plates where the door handles would go. Yeah, filled in a lot of the holes and stuff so I could refit things on this cab. Yeah, detailed out the fifth wheel pendant, where it'll pivot. Put the kingpin release handle on there. Modifying the exhaust. And uh, that's the deck plate that'll go in there once it's all painted and aluminumized but he's got blood ox red interior and uh you know even did the peterbilt logo on the steering wheel if you can see it got the one on the heater box but you can't really see it too well um let's see if i can turn this around yeah you can kind of see it but it's so small uh He's got a stainless control panel on the side dash. 